I have baby lashes. Hello everybody! It is Dingle here and welcome or welcome back to my channel. How are you all doing? I hope you all are doing super super duper well. And welcome back to a new, new Makeup Monday. A new, new Makeup Monday. Where I test out a product that I have not yet tested myself, that I've been watching for a while, or a product that is new to the market. Before we get into this, I am in no way a beauty guru. For those of you who are new to this channel, I do not claim to be a makeup artist, beauty guru, makeup professional at all. I'm just the average girl that really enjoys playing with makeup. So if that's something that you're into, then keep on watching. Today, you all, I am extremely excited to be testing out the very new Bad Gal Bang. Is that upside down? No, yes it is. No, it's right side up. Bad Gal Bang Mascara by Benefits. This had a huge launch. I think it's been about a month to two months officially since it has released and they have like all of these makeup artists and beauty gurus and like youtubers all out in the desert for this huge launch which was so cool i watched all of the vlogs that the beauty gurus put out there and it was it looked so so awesome i knew that as soon as my current mascara favorite which is the tarte lights camera lashes mascara i knew as soon as that ran out that i was going to get my hands on this one to try so I was in sephora the other day i went in to actually get the new cat von D studded lipstick. Let me know if you want a review on that. I would be happy to do it. But anyway, I was in there to get that and then I saw this in the little sample type of section where like it's kind of where the lines are and it was $12 and I figured before I go for the bigger one, I might as well go for this smaller one and Jack Jack, my lovely husband, purchased this for me as a little present. So thank you, Jack Jack. I can't wait to try this out. <laughs> so immediately on the package, I love the color Coloring. It's all black, pink. This is all embossed right here. Love this so much. Has a lot of information along here. It's got a little galaxy situation going on. And I just really love the aesthetic of this launch. Let me read a little bit about it. So they claim that this is 36 hour full blast volume and they have a before and after picture, which is like awesome. So let's see if that actually is true on my lashes. 90% said that they saw dramatic volume and 92% said that it did lengthen their lashes. Lashes. It says big volume with 360 degree reach around the lashes. Streamline to easily reach root to tip, corner to corner, upper and lower lashes. There are a lot of claims right in here. So let's quit talking about it and let's open it. So I think the number one reason I was so excited to try this is because my lashes are non-existent. I don't have anything on them now. So before you're like, yeah, they're really non-existent. They're really, really bad right now. I have nothing like on them, but still you can see naturally I have baby lashes. So I'm always down to try anything that says that it's voluminizing and will help me lengthen my lashes. So as soon as I open it, the packaging inside is just super cool. There's like this studded cap right here with the body being awesome. All the same colors as the actual package that it comes in, which is really cool. Let's go ahead and take a look at this one. Oh, huh interesting wand you guys so it's fatter on this end of it and it gets a little skinnier towards there the bristles are not very long which is interesting for a lengthening volumizing mascara from what I've tested out in the past nothing else too out of the ordinary just that the bristles go from like fatter to skinnier as well as the wand goes from fatter to skinnier let's go ahead and curl these puppies and try this out Alrighty, here we go. Alright, right off the bat, it's doing something. It's doing something, faux show. Sure. It is not very clumpy so far, which I am really liking. The finer bristles are doing a job that makes it not clumpy and I really like that. One of my other volumizing mascaras I have is The Shock by YSL. And while it does give me lashes, 
and make them look very long, it does plump up a lot. But these ones are make me look like I have more lashes than I actually do. So, so far, so good. Let's finish this up. All right, guys, so far, so really good. I don't know if you guys can see that, but this is clearly the length of my lashes naturally. And then this is the length of my lashes with Bad Gal Bang. And they are not clumpy. They're still very naturally wispy, which I really, really like. They're giving me some lashes going on. So normally I would like to accompany this with some liner just to fill it out a little bit. But I just wanted to test out how natural they could actually be without looking like I have super clumpy lashes on. So I really, really like that. They are keeping a pretty good curl. I might curl them a little bit more, but let's go ahead and get back into the eye that is naked right now. I zoomed you guys in a little bit so you guys could see the final look. Nothing extremely, like, insanely life-changing. However, I really love the volume that it has given me on my lashes. This one has a little bit more of a curl to it than this one over here, but that just might be me curling them. Um, I do love how forgiving this wand is. It's very bendy, which makes it not very stiff when I am applying the mascara to my eyelashes, meaning it's very forgiving, and I really like that. The other thing that I really liked is how it went from fat to skinny. Some of the mascaras go have like a weird squiggly thing, some just go straight across with the same length of the bristles from start to finish. But I love how the length of the bristles here went from fat to skinny because the fatter side was meant to get a lot of these outer lashes where the inner skinnier side was meant to get these inner less like volumizing lashes and I was able to use the skinnier side to get very natural looking under eyelashes. That was one go and one coat at the lashes. So I'm gonna apply a second coat real quick off camera and I'll be right back. I am back with the second coat on and as you can see, it does get a little clumpier the more coat that you put on. So if you're going for more of that natural look, then I would stick to the one coat. And if you're going for more of the more voluminous look, then you can put on two coats. It definitely made a difference for me. You can see it more on this eye, which is a little more curled than this eye. Also ignore the atrocity that is my eyebrows. We're ignoring that. We'll fix them soon. I promise. So I would say overall, I am really impressed with this mascara. I read a few reviews that said it might be a little clumpy, which made me think it was like the Shock YSL mascara that I already have. So it had me a little worried. That's why I kind of got the small bottle before I went for the big bottle, but I really, really like it. My lashes right now are very lightweight, which is kind of unheard of for a long lasting volumizing mascara. So I really, really enjoy it. It gives me that wispy feeling that the Tarte Lights Camera Lashes mascara that is my current favorite it gives me and so if this lasts longer and gives me actually more length with my lashes I am all for it. Thanks for testing out this mascara with me. I really loved having you all along. Let me know in the comments below if you would like to try this mascara or if you are like no way Jose that does not look like something that I would enjoy. I would love to know your opinion. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video do not forget to give it a big old thumbs up because it lets me know that you liked it and if you're new here and have watched all the way to the end of the video don't forget to smash the subscribe button before you leave. I would love to have you along on my channel with me and I appreciate each and every single one of you who come and watch my videos. I really, really do and I will catch all of you next time. See you later!